the East. Jack Burford Chevrolet presents Race Week at the Richmond Raceway in Richmond, Kentucky. Here's your host in all things racing, Bill Lupino. Hey everybody, welcome to this week's Richmond Race Week, sponsored by Jack Perkins Chevrolet at the Richmond Raceway. Bill, big race this past weekend. Give us the details. Buckeye Outlaw Sprint Series made their second visit. Should have been their fourth, but their second visit right, right, uh, exactly, down to see us. Right. And we don't have any local sprint cars, 410 sprint cars. You know, we right. don't run them around here. So they okay. brought us a full field for them, which is 22 cars, which okay. is a great turnout. We, I mean, right, right. You know, they normally start 22 everywhere they go, mm-hmm. and they brought us exactly 22. So you Excellent. can't complain about that. No, you know, no, it was, right. It was good so field. you had exactly 22. Exactly 22 okay. sprint right. cars. So cool. we were happy. Cool. Um, Aaron there with the, with the series, he was happy. He said, you know, okay. full field. Excellent. Can't go wrong with that. You know, okay. they could do their normal program and that type of thing. Right. So, you know, we had Mother Nature to play with. Absolutely. <laughs> Tell us about that. You know, 15, 18 mile an hour winds, and the sun came out, and all that. Dries out quick. Yeah. Dries out quick, but you know we we worked all day. Um, okay. Got to you know thank my my guy Thomas who shows up nice and early and helps me roll the track in and work on it. And we kept watering and watering and watering and right. you know, we knew with the sun still up, sure, and the heat that we were going to have the dry dusty. Yes, you know you got to yes. kind of sacrifice the early part to get to sunset. Right, and you know we knew the heat races were going to be one lane and mm-hmm. dusty and dom- you know dominant bottom. But we knew all that. Sure, you know I don't I know fans don't like that. Right, and we don't want that, but sometimes just the way it is, it's Mother Nature, Mother I mean, Nature. So you know you the plan was to get to sunset right hopefully it was only nine o'clock we were to mm-hmm. that part of our program that we have the intermission which it was it worked right. out sure you know okay, i was watching good. the time right. the whole time like yeah. hey, we're good right and right. you know jumped in water truck did the top lake we've been doing mm-hmm. you know the guys rolled it in the sprint cars came out for their feature and helped roll on top a little bit more for us and then they just put on a, a great show i mean yeah. the first four or five laps are kind of down around the bottom letting the top dry a little bit and then they started racing their slide sure. jobs right. and i mean slide job here slide job it was all over the racetrack and it was really, really good. I mean, it still was dusty because it was, you know, dry, yeah, exactly, but right. the racing was fantastic. Sprint cars just put on a phenomenal good, show. Excellent. We did have one gentleman leave the track. That's what you said. Yeah, over between turn one and two, the same place, a little bit further toward turn one than the guy left that the track four the years time. ago. But right. the guy did leave the track. He was okay. I didn't actually see it, but I will hopefully get to see the video of what exactly right. happened to him. But he got out. He was okay. Car was way off in the trees. Had to right. wait till the end of the night. And then, you know, my guys, you know, Ed and... Chris and Thomas and all them. Roger went out and fished it out and got it out. Right, and did got a really it, good got job with that. So what happens in that turn? They just sometimes they just lose it. There's no catch fence outside turn catch one fence. and okay. two. So when they would you know slide up the track like they were doing, like it, I said, I didn't see the video yet, right. but I'm assuming he just just a little too much, right? A little bit too much. Gotcha. But you know, there's a gentleman. I don't know all their names, obviously, but there's a gentleman mm-hmm. number eleven that was just all over the racetrack. He was slide jobbing here and passing this one, and he ended up finishing third. Wow. And the winner was um, Isaac Chapel, who was actually a USAC racer from up north there, and he okay. just started sixth um came up to win um slide job for the lead i mean they were just it was it was really good it was, it was just really, a really, really good, good race saturday yes. that's what uh, i heard yeah, just a really, really good race, good race. Right. and then you know that the top kind of went away because of them using it sure, all up so absolutely. then the rest of the night was back to kind of bottom dominant and not really a lot of passing you know kind right. of happens not right. what you want but it kind of happens sure but you know uh derek fisher won second straight okay for the super sonic super late models and like i said to him in victory lane not as exciting as his you know finish from the last oh, time oh you're because, right you know, exactly like but it, he still got a win you know defending track champion and he's now back in the point lead Cool. So, you know, got that. And then um, the third race of the American Racer South Super Stock Series was mm-hmm. here at Richmond. And okay. the current point leader for the series and track point leader and defending track champion, Logan Preston, won. So, oh, good. Yep. so good. he's Excellent. Uh, moving right along. And our next race cool. for them is uh, July 23rd, actually, up in Ohio. We're up headed Ohio. to Jackson, Ohio, okay. to uh, gotcha. Jackson County Speedway. Okay. That'll be the next race for the series. Right. Uh, the KDR Super Sox will be back in action at Richmond next time. At race. Richmond, okay. Yep. And then uh, Eagle Finance UMP Modifieds came out. Um, Zach Powers, Aaron Branham on the front row, and I swear it took 17,000 restarts to finally get that race going. Really? the guys in the back just kept wrecking and wrecking and wrecking and wrecking. Wrecking, 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 wrecking. And once we finally got it going, um, Aaron Branham took lead and, you know, had more cautions. And then sure. he held on to win. It's his third time visiting us this season and his third win. And his so, third win. Yeah, every so time he, Aaron races that's doing pretty season, good. Yeah, he wins. And Zach got another second, which okay. I think every single week I mentioned Zach Powers a second. He's doing a great he's job. Doing, he just right. hasn't gotten that first win of the he's year He's got to get... Over yeah. the hump. But, right. he, you know, he's running great, you know, Good. his fast time. And got another second. He's currently our point leader for the Mile okay. So, you know, right. Zach's doing, doing really well. Um, now we're taking a couple weeks off and going to do some work. we got to wait for Mother Nature here today with yes. the, to rain on us a little bit and get some rubber off the track softened up a little. And then my right. son Adam will get out on a grader later this week. We'll okay. grader up. Then we're going to get the tractor running and ripper up because we have the time off. And, okay. you know, she's so getting a little hard. Okay, okay. So, yep, we're going to rip her up. 
the letter said wide open. If we don't get any more rain, we're going to water ourselves over the next couple of weeks and get to work Let's on it and the we'll put it back together. Got it. Okay. Grade her back up, get her watering again, and get ready for July 10th. So we Excellent. do have a plan. Hopefully, Excellent. you know, we'll work and we'll, right. we'll get going. And, of course, all the race results, pictures, and all that good stuff yep. is on the website. Yes, and we have not gotten, well, by the time this airs, we will. We haven't sure, gotten our, our pictures right. yet on the Facebook page. We'll be doing right. that tonight because, you know, we film on Monday exactly. for people we that don't know Monday. that. Right. Um, we'll get those Jimmy Pittman photos, okay. pictures up tonight and, uh, you know, get all the other information everywhere it needs to be. Absolutely. So tell us about the next race coming up and what's coming up next couple weeks. Yes, we are off until July 10th. Okay. Um, next week, we basically took the week off because we didn't really have any series to come in town. We looked around, see sure. what's going on. We know that Atomic Speedway up there in Ohio is running a two-day Atomic 100 show. Um, mm -hmm. A Friday-Saturday deal, 12,000 win Friday. So, you okay. know, hopefully people go up and check that out because, right. you know, be good, should be a good yeah, race. It you know, should be. 12,000 yeah, wins, super right. models. Absolutely. And then July 4th weekend, we just won't race because it's July 4th weekend. Right. We know a lot of people like to go and do different things. They go to the lake, they go right. camping, they do family things. Uh, Lucas Oil Late Model Series is up in Ohio for okay. that weekend. They right. Are. It is that weekend. So, you know, there's just stuff going on. So right. We just and then July 4th is on a Sunday yep. this year. Yep. So, so okay. just taking July 4th weekend off. Excellent. Going to, okay. like you said, work on the grounds, work on the track, sure. do a bunch of stuff. We don't take time off even if we're not racing, but, you know. It's, it's always a full then, time Oh, job. yeah. People <laughs> don't know. Then we'll roll right back into july 10th okay. um we're inviting back the american modified series okay and they're coming in for a five thousand dollar to win modified show so it should be huge yes uh we expect a lot of a lot of modified guys we had a really good turnout when they came race with us last year and now this year it's going to be five thousand to win which is right. really big for the modified oh, that's guys. big 5k yes wow. so we're going to run that and then um we're going to be running our pro late models for a thousand win and our air bodies cater a super socks for 750 so just okay. the three classes with the big modified show sure then the very next week, we are going to be really busy here in July. July 17th is the 7th Annual Butch Shea Memorial. Oh, right. 5,000 to win Ultimate Heart of America Super Late Models. Oh, okay, yep. cool. And that would be a full program with the Pro Late Models, Modifieds, and Super Sex as well. Sweet. Then I mentioned the next Friday, the 23rd, we're taking the AR Bodies, oh, I'm sorry, the American Racer South Super Sex Series up to Ohio. Right. To Jackson County for a $1,200 to win show. And then we're coming right back that Sunday, okay. July 25th. With the Summer Nationals. Oh, this Sunday. Okay, yes. nice. Okay. Yep, that's the Sunday night that we're running at 6 p.m. Judge okay. Taylor let us run late oh, later cool, that day. Oh, cool, cool, so, yep. nice. That'll be Summer Nationals, Sunday known as race. the Hell Tour, okay. which is $5,000 to win Super Late Models and $1,500 to win UMP Modifieds. Sure. And then the following weekend, we're taking our Ultimate Heart of America series up to Indiana oh. for uh, in Circle City in Indianapolis on Friday night for 5000 to win, Shady Hill up in Indiana, 5000 to win Saturday night, and then Sunday, August 1st, right back at Circle City for 5000 to win. Oh, nice. We get so, some big money coming up. Yes, so once nice. we get going into July, we are going to be very, very busy running yes. all over the place with a different series, running here at the track three straight weeks, and hopefully people will follow us up to Ohio for the Super Stocks, right. follow us up to Indiana for the, the Ultimate right. Heart of America, and should be really busy. But, wow, yeah. July is a July will be packed fun. race yes. month. Well, that, be fun. That's, that's great and big money too yes. and of course all that is available on your website schedules facebook page yeah. twitter all that stuff so Everything. make sure you watch uh richmond raceway yeah. uh, because all that information is there now tell us about concessions bill for the upcoming races um as of now we're gonna be doing the same stuff we're doing all right and good. saturday just went really really well Excellent. with concessions i mean sure. sold out of all the snappy tomato pizza both fridays wow. sold right out um, like I like always that. forget to mention the chew on this jerky, but this weekend we sold quite a bit of that also. Oh, really? What kind yep. of jerky? Uh, it's chew on this jerky oh, out of California. Oh, okay, cool. And I was actually eating some in the infield, and one of my guys saw me eating it, went and got some themselves. Well, got some, uh, nice. Okay. Yeah, he's like, oh. I forgot you guys had that. And that sold really well for us this weekend. Good. It's really good, good stuff. People Excellent. should give it a try. It's not available in the stores here locally. Right, right. So, you know, if you want to try it, you got to try it at the restaurant. And then you can Excellent. order it online from the guys okay. out there. Um, Eric and Grace Bolas run the okay. company, and, you know, they'll ship it right to you. Okay. And, you know, just everything. Went really well. The hot dogs sold well. The chili dogs. The Italian sausage everything, went well again. Went. Popcorn went well. The Nobody went goes well. away hungry. No, not if you, if you want to eat, you can eat. Fantastic. So and the concession staff worked really hard. I mean, it was right. hot and muggy and yes, hot it in was. those concession yes, stands. Yes, it is. Yep. They, you know, they did a really good job for us as well. Excellent. So. Uh, and I was by earlier. Uh, we did a little promo with tourism. I don't know if you saw it or not, but the, mm -hmm. the, the, the track and the grounds will look fantastic. I try. <laughs> I <laughs> didn't even know you were there. Build on that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I do hey, all that. We sneak in. We sneak out. I, I do all the mowing myself. Excellent. My wife does all the weed whacking. Fantastic. You know, we do all the grounds up, keep ourselves, all right. the picking up the garbage, which looked was all day really, yesterday. Yeah, it looked really good. You know, keeping up all the signage and, right. you know, the painting and everything's us. You know, it's uh, just the four also of us. Mention, also mention accommodations, quality. Uh, quality in. Quality in. Um, like I always mentioned, find their mm -hmm. link on their logo on our website on the sponsor page, yep. and you get a discount if you want to stay there. With the upcoming races that we have, you know, we'll have some out-of-town guests with the Modifieds and the, right. the Super Late Models and also fans coming in, too. Definitely right. check out Quality Inn. Excellent. It's a really nice place. They it is a job. really nice place. Yeah, yeah. They, they, they really do a great job out there. Bill, one more time, uh, 
social media, website, all the information yes. for the upcoming races for July. Richmond Race Week KY, uh, Facebook and Twitter. Okay. Um, if people want to see what's going on with the Ultimate Heart of America series, we're also on Facebook and Twitter, Ultimate okay. Heart of America Super Late Model Series. And I always update everything on there too. When right, I the saw events that. Right. are at my track, I'll share, okay. you know, cross, unilaterally cross share, share right. everything. Okay. And then I also have the Super Sex Series page also okay. on Facebook as well. That's oh, not cool. on Twitter. Cool. But people okay. can check that out as well. And Excellent. I kind That's of manage nice. all that stuff and I'm always throwing things out everywhere. And, Oh, I'm, I'm sure. <laughs> it, hey, follow them on Twitter and Facebook because they're all over the place, folks. So yes. no uh, lack of information. That's for we sure. try. <laughs> Absolutely. All right, Bill. Thanks for joining us, folks. Big racing month in July at yes. Richmond Raceway. Follow them, share them. And we have to thank 28 Designs, Ken Short, oh, right here absolutely. in Richmond for all Thanks. the great posters everybody sees. Absolutely. Um, he all does all that graphics. stuff and he, he does Fantastic. a great job. Have to thank him weekly because, you know, back in the day, I would put something together that looked awful. Oh, sure. Or then you just put out, you know, <laughs> little nice written words. Good graphics, and good graphics, now, good graphics. You know, he yeah, hooks me up with sure. these just absolutely perfect and beautiful posters they do. with all the information. So they look thank fantastic. Him. Thanks again. Yes. All right. Hey, folks, we'll see you next time on Jack Burford Chevrolet's Richmond Race Week from the Richmond Raceway. Thanks, Bill. Thank you.